Namaskar. You are watching Topper Stock series, and today in this session of Topper Stock, uh, we have Nambi Mirdupani. She has secured All India Rank 21 in Electronics and Telecommunication in Engineering Services 22. Uh, Nambi Mirdupani, uh, congratulations to you and your family for this wonderful achievement of your life. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Uh, so before I start discussing with her regarding her preparation and all those things. Uh, uh, so I would like to introduce, uh, uh, she has done uh, her engineering from uh, GNITS uh, Hyderabad, Telangana, 2019 pass out. And uh, after that, uh, uh, she started to prepare for the competitive examinations. If I recall, last year also you appeared in interviews, but could not make it up to the final list. So uh, from last year to this year, uh, what did you improve? What were the things you, which you learned from your last experience? Yes, sir. So du this, uh, during this phase from last year to this year, this was really tough phase for me mm -hmm. because uh, going up to the interview and then could not make into the final list, really, it, uh, it, uh, it makes us feel very bad. I was like disheartened. I was in a confusion also whether to give the next attempt or not. So, and then my family and especially I have my uh, yeah, elder brother. He is also working in Airport Security of India currently. Okay. So, so he supported me a lot. He motivated me that, uh, uh, sir, uh, that my first attempt was in 2020. So, mm -hmm. Yeah, so at that time, uh, unfortunately, after the prelims exam, the railways vacancies were withdrawn. Mm -hmm. So, uh, so uh, I was very confident that I will clear prelims and uh, I started preparing for mains also that time. So, mm -hmm. and then unfortunately, the cutoff went high and uh, unluckily, sir, the cutoff was 245 and I got 244. I lost mm -hmm. with just one mark, mm -hmm. that prelims. Mm -hmm. So that again, uh, so my brother last year, he motivated me like last year, you were just short of one mark. And this year, who knows, uh, like you will be short of few marks only and then you have to prepare your, it's your goal. Then so they, my family and my parents, they motivated me a lot. And uh, so the first thing uh, I have improved from last year to this year is uh, uh, I have improved my basics. I'm uh, not just basics. I made the whole concept much more stronger mm -hmm. so that I can answer the question in multiple dimensions. Like if the question, if a question is asked, uh, so not only just to the point, answering it to the point, like the presentation way and uh, how to answer it properly. And then uh, also uh, so then, uh, made the concepts more clear. Last year was my first main, so mm. I could not completely uh, get the concept 100%, like up to the mark. Mm. I was in the preparation only, but up to the mark, uh, after giving this attempt, I felt that last year was not up to the mark. Perfect. So that's, yes. So this year, I um, like last year was my very serious attempt. So like uh, uh, I have done whatever the groundwork is required. Mm -hmm. All have done for last year uh, thing only, and this year I just improved uh, uh, upon that groundwork, and then uh, I cleared prelims means and then got finally twenty first rank. Good, good, good. Uh, uh, what is the role of test series during this preparation? How did you utilize this? Uh, because uh, means uh, you have to write uh, three three hours of two papers. So uh, how was it helpful? How did you use this uh, test and all these? Things? Yes, sir. so uh, this year I haven't taken any test series because I was short of time. Mm. Uh, so I completely focused on uh, previous years only. Mm. But uh, last year I have uh, took a test series. Mm. So that uh, last year I, ha I with the test series, it was helpful for me, but uh, by managing the time, like you have to write the three hours of test stretch and uh, the questions and also you have to uh, uh, analyze which questions to attempt in that time and then uh, again you have to select the questions uh, if, if something goes wrong then again you have to start from the beginning uh, mm -hmm. selecting the questions and also with the test series uh, I, uh, I have managed how to uh, uh, with the test series I got how to manage the time properly in three hours like to complete the question paper because it is very difficult to complete the question paper entirely right. uh, so with the test series I have uh, 
so that last year test series only like uh, i have managed how to complete the paper in, within time and uh, this year uh, because i have a uh, short of time i could not uh, attempt any test series so i completely focused on uh, previous years only right uh this is a, a a huge slavers uh, and you have to do long hours study uh, for a uh, completion of the slavers and then practice uh, uh sometimes so when we go for long hour study then uh, mind get distracted uh, sometimes yes. negative thoughts started to creep uh, sometimes uh, thoughts like that comes ki, let's uh, stop the preparation whether i can do it or not probably such kind of thoughts may have also been coming in your mind so how did you overcome those uh, negativities yes sir uh, sir uh, first of all the negativity not only for me it is common for every aspirant right. who right. are preparing for upsc especially upsc right. so uh, so like it is very tough to clear this competitive much more competitive exam so then uh, in between definitely the thoughts will come because all our uh, classmates and friends they'll uh, they are going to abroad they are enjoying and then we fail sometimes what is this like we are stuck sucking in a single room we are studying for hours and hours and we do not know we are sailing in the right boat or not so sometimes we do not know even if we, even can we sail to to the bank or not we we may also think so that uh, like uh, multiple thoughts uh, will come to our brain so the main motive is sir uh, like we have to surround uh, our surroundings with positive people like yeah family or friends uh, siblings so they uh, constantly motivated me uh, this is your time uh, you have to give this but But even I also felt personally that sir, uh, looking down the line for ten years or so. So if we are not in this field and so choosing some other field, then definitely I would have regretted. Uh, uh, if I would have given one more attempt at that time, maybe this could be a different thing, whole different thing. Yeah. So I have resources, I have the perseverance to study, and I have family support. Then why not to give this uh, attempt? So that uh, motivated. So that thing I've motivated myself constantly. And uh, my brother, he's a uh, uh, like he's more is my motivator, um, a constant supporter, and what not. Like he also he constantly mentored me uh, what I have studied, and that, uh, so that thing uh, helped me a lot during this whole uh, preparation. Right, right. You, uh, uh, you mentioned a point. Uh, that sometimes thoughts come. Uh, friends are going to abroad. They are enjoying. So now, what is the response of those friends who are in abroad after this your success? And uh, yes. how do you you feel? Okay, how is this decision now? Yes, uh, they were uh, they were quite happy. Like everyone, uh, uh, even from my friends of some of from abroad, so they call me and then we were so happy for you. So they, they even so that made me yes. Uh, the, this thing, this uh, this achievement has made my day. I have on the right. I, I'm on the right path. I'm going in my direction. What I have needed, what I have achieved, for my goal. So I have achieved it. So ultimately, at the end of the day, what you have done is. the most important thing the uh, the work you are doing so on that work you have to get satisfaction so that satisfaction you need to get so whatever work you do maybe maybe you go to a broad uh, or to psc or another any services bureaucrat and so so that satisfaction is the most important thing so for this satisfaction i have worked almost 3 years so i struggled for 3 years and then finally i achieved so they were also very happy it's it's a, in fact it's not a struggle i can say. it is actually the um, time in which uh, uh, you built your personality and uh, this is yes. lifetime experience today yes, when i am um, um, participating with you in this interaction i am uh, watching a different nambi mrithupani which i used to see two years back uh, during mock interviews so actually this journey makes you a different personality this i used to tell in the class also ki this preparation is going to make you a better a confident a better person a confident person and uh, a personality jisne apni negativities ko overcome kar liya ho so i am very happy matlab i can recall uh, what happens uh, i have seen new people growing i have seen new uh in the mock interview stages in other stages uh, ki at that time less confident at that time lots of uh, if and but in the mind and today you are uh, delivering things with uh, such a confidence uh, 
so this is the process basically which refine your personality uh, nambi uh, i'm very happy yes, uh, so. that you are sharing your journey with the uh, young uh, so before we end this session um, i give you an opportunity to share anything which you want to share with young aspirants or you want to say thank to anybody or you want to share anything with your family member if you want to this platform to share anything you are free to share yes sir. so the only like the advice i would like to give the young aspirants is so uh, like sometimes we get disheartened we 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 become low, very low in our whole process because this is not overnight journey like overnight uh, if we study overnight then we can get uh, so and so this is not such thing so we have to work hard Uh, we have to work that hard work has to be done by everyone Up, upon that hard work you if you want to become the top or if you want to top the exam you have to do, do the smart work so the yeah. hard work will do by everyone so that is common for all so with that smart work it will make you different from uh, it gives you an urge to stand amongst uh, different uh, other persons so that smart work you have to choose wisely whether it may be the strategy you are approaching whether it may be solving it, it depends upon the different persons some will solve many test series like right. many number of questions and some are just uh, will go through some will go through the concepts uh, many number of times to get remembered and then some will like uh, follow the previous years strategy so uh, personally sir i followed previous years questions paper strategy because there is this guy called upsc so he just uh, not only upload the question papers in the in his in the website for the for those records but it is also for us to analyze them work on them like we can get that trend which type of questions the uh, examination is being asked so that trend if we catch on that then definitely success will come to our hand but uh, provided we have to work hard and then this smart work and these techniques also we have to inculcate according to the trend wise so then we can uh, achieve and then finally sir i would like to thank my family who supported me throughout this journey because uh, a woman like uh, of uh, nearly 24 years old and then the society pressure family and all so that pressure they have uh, has, they haven't reached that pressure to me so they have stopped uh, they had made a wall to me and then they supported me my brother also is a constant supporter and motivator so uh, and then my friends also they always supported me and then whenever i am in a low or a uh, mood and all so they have uh, uh, they are, like they have called me then this you can do it this is your uh, this is your achievement this is your goal so they have yeah. so they also motivated me so i thank everyone and then my faculty uh, who supported me and then in mock, mock interviews also i have received very good uh, uh, good feedback then how to achieve uh, how to be confident enough so uh, the one thing sir attending the mock interviews i have learned is so sometimes you will get a question which is unknown definitely obviously you will not get right. all the questions 100% that you you will know in the interview right. Right. so so uh, which the unknown questions how to answer it with confident so mm-hmm. that can't sometimes you get panic you uh, mm-hmm. you will search for answers so mm-hmm. that uh, confident has to reflect in your face so mm-hmm. that uh, while attending the mock interviews i've learned that and then i th- i thank everyone who are part of my journey and uh, yes sir i am so happy right now. <laughs> yes 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 you should be happy eh? celebrate this great success of your life and again i would like to congratulate you and your family for this wonderful result and i wish uh, you uh, a bright future ek bahut achhi officer baniye and serve this country in the best possible manner so thank you uh, nambi mrutpani for joining us thanks a lot and keep inspiring to the young generation thank you sir thank you so much